Okay, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be working on the Impala and we're going to put that front end together. So here we go. This is uh, the bench. I had to use two. <laughs> so I got bolts. A lot of them. I'm sure I'm missing a couple. <clears throat> got the lower, what would you call it, balance? Lower bumper. Got the bumper. The little sides. Got this piece that bolts onto the bottom of the grill right there. Got the lower part of the grill that bolts on to this. The grill. And those two things bolt on right here on the bottom. And it bolts onto the fender, the battery tray, and one goes to the light. <clears throat> so I got the left and right side. And then those bolt onto the frame and then to the bumper. And then we got these. But I don't have screws for those, so I don't know if we're gonna be able to put it on. But if you guys can believe it, I found most of this stuff in the trunk. Under door panels and all kinds of crap. Except for this part. This part had it hanging on my uh, fence, if you guys been paying attention. But everything else was in the trunk oh and the grill was in the front seat those two were in the front seat i didn't put them in the back but <sighs> time to send this down primary gray primer that gray uh what else what else i gotta send those two three four five six things down and uh paint those black semi-gloss black and once we got everything painted i'll come back with you guys and we'll start putting things together. All right, so time to put this on. That piece. So let's get it. Ah. Alright, so that's what that looks like right there. Hopefully it's right. So it's got two right there. One, two, and then one bolts onto the the bucket. Let me get down here. Alright, so one, two, three. I don't know what goes right here yet, but I'm gonna wait till I put on the grill. <clears throat> so that's one side. Now, time to do the other side. 
All right, so that's what it looks like. That's one side. That's the other side, right there. Now, I just got done putting this together, the grill. Yeah. I still gotta clean that part. But, that's what I'm using. Painted the bottom black, the little screws. Now let's put it on. Alright, so this is where we're at. So I got the grill on. Alright, one screw right there. One screw right there. And then I got one right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. And also, I don't know if you guys can see it. There's one right there, right there, uh, right there, and right there. And I haven't tightened them up yet, because I don't know if I have to t remove any of them to put the rest of the parts, but that's the bottom uh, balance, if you want to call it. I'm trying to build everything that I can outside of the car before I put it on. Here are the bolts. So you, one right there. Right there, right there, right there, right there, right there, and right there. And then also, I put these on. You can see, it's two, one, two, and it's also loose because those three, one, two, three, bolt on to right here somewhere. But yeah, so I'm gonna keep going, get back with you guys. All right, so here's the mess that I got going on. Now I'm trying to build everything I can before I put it on. So that's the lower uh, bumper balance thingy. I bolted up the grill to it, right there. And also bolted up the bumper to it, so. Um, the bolt right there. Time to install that piece and that piece because I think that's what goes right here. So, let's do that real quick. Alright, so now we got those in, those S shaped brackets. And they go bolted on right there and right there. <clears throat> Here's the other one. Goes bolted on right there and right there. And these are loose. So <clears throat> now I'm trying to show you guys uh, most of the process, but I don't want to make a long video. And also, I don't know which pieces go on, goes on first, like in what order. So hopefully I don't have to take none of this apart to put something else on, but 
we'll see. All right, so this is the process, progress we got going. Um, so I just bolted up the bumper <coughs> with one right there. And I don't have the, oh, I do have some. <coughs> These are supposed to go there, but I got the bigger ones. All right. Then I went back and I got these, but these are too small. So I need the one that goes in the middle. So I'm going to use a regular nut and bolt for now. But <clears throat> I got one right there and one right there. Now I have to put those on for it to hold it up and push it in. So let me do that real quick. All right, update. So, I got that bracket, all right? Oh, let me get it, see if it kicks. I mean, oh, I could be too close, I don't know where I'm at. All right, so, that bracket bolts onto that bolt right there. So I have to take off that bolt in order for it to lay on that hole too. So it's going to be the bottom balance, the chrome bumper, and then on top is going to be this bumper bracket. So all those three have to go in that same hole. And also, I don't know if you guys can see it. Maybe that hole goes right there. So let's keep going. This is tedious work. Uh, here's the update. So I got all the bolts on. Um, everything's still loose. So I got that one on. Those two, one, two. And then right there you can see that one bolts on to that bracket. <coughs> oh, anyway. Let me show you on this side. So I got this one on, and that bolts onto the S bracket on the bottom. I got this one on, and that one bolts onto the one that goes all the way over there. So one, two, right here. And that one bolts on to no metal. Can you guys see? Hopefully, you can. To that one right there. And then that one bolts on right there, right there. <coughs> anyway. And right there. Um I scratched the shit out of everything. See that? Scratched it. Over here, scratched it. It's hard doing this by yourself. You just scratch everything. So mad props to all those body guys that can put a whole cart together without scratching it after paint. Scratched it. But uh got all the brackets on, all the bolts on, they're all loose. So now I got the jack. I'ma jack it up and push it in. And uh hopefully we can get it right. So let's do that.
All right, so now we're gonna put this piece. And the way this bolts on is these things. So right there, right there, and right there. So those little thingies go in there somehow. Right there, and then one screw right here, and one screw over here. But I don't know, I don't have like a bracket on this side or nothing. So, I mean, I don't know, but I do have one right here, so let's do that. I didn't even clean these up right here. I didn't clean the grill for this piece. I just sanded things down and painted them. I mean, this isn't the first or last time it's gonna t be taken apart and put back together. So I just want to drive this damn thing to the other side. Anyways, that's it, I guess. Whatever. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, so there it is. That's what it looks like. Um, so that side is higher than this side. So I gotta go lower right there so I can put that bezel in. But, uh, yeah, look at that. Not bad. Finally, we got a front end on this thing. Uh, now I gotta go order uh, marker lights right there. I got them somewhere. Well, I guess I can clean these up or something. Just order the lens, but I don't know. We'll see. Depends on how much it is. So there it is. That's what it looks like. I wanted to show the whole process, but um, it was stressing trying to get all the bolts in with things in the way, and uh, the video would have been hella long, so I didn't want that. So I tried to show uh, most of how to do it, but there it is. So thanks for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe, and now. We got to get some tires for it. We'll be able to drive it on the street kind of somewhat. It's already registered and everything. So I wouldn't mind driving it with no windows. Custom AC. Alright guys. Thanks for watching.